Turning up the temperature on your water heater is easy. You will likely have two access panels such as this, one at the top, one at the bottom. All you need to get them off is a Phillips head screwdriver. When dealing with anything electronic or electric, you want to turn off the power first. So we did that, remove the panel, and then we're going to pull out the insulation here. Typically, if you've had one of these installed recently, um, they're typically set at the minimum 115, 120 degrees. So if you want a little bit hotter, most people do, you will access it this way and then get a flat head screwdriver. And you can see once we've opened the insulation there that there's a little dial, which the screwdriver fits in perfectly and you can turn it up as much as you want. I'm only doing a little bit at first just to see how that goes. I have two kids, so I certainly don't want to scold anybody and it can get pretty hot. So we're turning it up about 10 degrees there um, and we'll see how that goes. Put the panel back on and we're going to do the same for the second one now i did for demonstrative purposes you shouldn't do this go back outside and turn the electricity back on so that you can hear what happens when we are turning up the dial and you have not correctly um, turned off the power you'll hear this click and that is because heating element which that dial is um, connected to is kicking on and if it's kicking on then that means the power is not off so um, you always want to make sure that the power is off you want to make sure that breakers are labeled correctly in your electric panel and then just putting the access panel back on and if you ever need to turn the water off for any reason then you can go to this lever right here if you've got a leak in your water heater you'll simply want to turn that up so that it's perpendicular to the pipe right now it's parallel so that means the water is flowing.